Stonehenge is the most famous of Britain's stone circles. A visit starts at the museum, where you'll see artifacts from the Stone Age people who built it. A 360-degree theater demonstrates how the structure is aligned with the heavens, marking both the longest and the shortest days of the year. And outside, a thatched hut hamlet helps you imagine how its Neolithic builders once lived. Huge stones like this replica were quarried, carved, and then moved for many miles, some of them from as far away as Wales, 200 miles to the west. They barged them down rivers. They may have rolled them on logs like this. Nobody knows for sure. After this introduction, a bus shuttles you to the site. Visitors are in awe as they ponder the continuously debated purposes and meaning of Stonehenge. The major stones were erected at the end of the Stone Age, just before the advent of metal tools. It's amazing to think that some of these cross stones have been in place for four and a half thousand years. Whatever its original purpose, Stonehenge still functions as a celestial calendar. Even in modern times, the sun rises on the longest day of the year in just the right spot, and it retains its powerful sense of wonder over those who gather. For over 4,000 years in a row, this ensemble of stones, so artfully assembled, has silently done its duty. <laughs>